From you wake up every morning You a winner, yeah What's going on guys? It's a girl Razor in the brr d d zing Obviously if you saw the title you'll know that this is a vlog But I'm going to do it differently I'm going to do it in a story time type concept type of way I'm going to take you guys on my little staycation at home in the British Virgin Islands if you guys did not know I live on the island of Virgin Gorda and the BVI is made up of about 50 islands and keys and I live on the third biggest island which is Virgin Gorda for this staycation I basically explored every day and I was out almost every night and my friend well my best friend came to visit me from atlanta that made my staycation even more exciting this staycation explains my little absence from about a couple weeks ago because your girl was having fun okay i didn't have time for y'all i needed it my full-time job is about to start next week even though i was on vacation from my full-time job i still partaked in my side hustle it's not really a side hustle because i put in as much work and effort into this as well so i needed a break let's get into the video what's going on it's your girl razor in the brr the thing <laughs> so we're at the back of my dad's pickup truck real caribbean life you know we're about to go to the beach the bats okay. to be exact we're getting something to eat first yes. and then we're gonna head there <laughs> this is my bee she came to visit me she came to visit me from atlanta we're about to be lit invitation to somewhere you see yeah. <laughs> talk about the bats which is a popular tourist location in the British Virgin Islands it's located on Virgin Gorda but let's just say VG in walking distance right near the bats is Devil's Bay and I'm going to take you guys along the trail which is about 10 I won't say 10 to, oh, whew, about 15 minutes because I felt like we were walking forever I forgot how long it took to get down there but regardless the view is to die for when you actually get down on the beach so just just know you have a lot of walking to do and that's your exercise right there we have arrived we have to walk down a trail that's about 10 minutes let's go sunshine good breeze good food food on deck i haven't eaten for the day Oh, we've been walking forever and I'm sweating. You guys see all this sweat like glistening. We're here. We just made it to the beach. Taking a little shade before we head through the trail. Girl, what you doing? And we're about to get some drinks first. So my friend Alan is here. And he's going to get us some pina colada. <laughs> okay, we about to drive the boat. You ready? I'm finna drive the boat. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> We're about to eat first before we go down the trail. Tiny colada. <laughs> oh move your mother. <laughs> Island life. Chicken fried rice. Some wings. We about to dive into this food. It's an iguana. I'm sure. Oh don't run away. Don't run from me, friend. But Alan Weddison, no entry, exit only. What? All my life I had to fight. <laughs> All my life. All my life. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Oh, I've never seen something like this.
be around. Wow, guys, it's too much right now. Goodbye. See ya. This is how <laughs> nights with razor go. They usually involve hair, small talk, and a little bit of Hennessy. Just a little. Just a little bit tipsy. <laughs> Remember these days, guys. These vlogs. You guys are going to look back and be like, wow, they've really been doing it. Stay tuned. Question, because I got a lot of comments on my Instagram post when I posted this video. <laughs> take you guys to detangle your hair after the beach or the pool because for me it, it doesn't take that long it takes about the same time it would take for me to do my regular wash days a lot of people were commenting oh my gosh like I cannot imagine the detangling session after that what the what detangling session boo some nights were a lot more chill than others some nights we just went to the beach chillax and talk you know <laughs> just enjoy the sea breeze enjoyed walking on the beach and enjoy digging our feet in the sand the next day, we went to Anigata, second largest island in the British Virgin Islands. Prior to going there, we didn't have any plans. I just wanted to go <laughs> island hopping to the way that. Y'all are going to think I'm so crazy and reckless. Which I am, but <laughs> God is always on my side and God always has my back. And I usually don't do things like this, okay? So don't judge me. We went from Virgin Gorda to Anigata, which is about an hour boat ride. And Anigata is famous for the lobsters. Hear this story, right? Walking on the dock on Anigata. We didn't know what we were doing. We don't know. We didn't know where we were headed, right? This guy pulled up in a car. He said, hey, my friend did most of the talking. I was just like, I don't know you. <laughs> so he asked us, like, what we doing? Like, where y'all going? We were like, we don't know. We're new to the island. What is there to do? Basically, he was like, hop in. Let's go. So my friend looked at me i looked at her she was like you going we going i was like yeah let's go <laughs> yolo <laughs> the rest was a movie we had so much fun and anigata doesn't have that much people so if anything had to happen to us it wouldn't have went unnoticed but it was still risque <laughs> but new day new islands we're in anigata Beautiful British Virgin Islands. I'm hungry. I don't even know you. <laughs> How Help. dare you? Help! This might be your last time seeing us because we just hopped in some random car. We are in Anagata. This is about an hour away from the island we were just previously on, which was Virgin Garda. If we go missing, you know where we at. The camera Tell my mama I love her. <laughs> Pray for us, y'all. We crazy. <laughs> Crazy. Let me try to show y'all these guys so we have evidence. Where he at? There he goes. So if anything happened to us, this is the guy. <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> Don't know that a Kamiari, aka yes. Kevin, in any gala. Again, make sure they have a good time. But nothing gonna happen to them. No mind. You sure? We were so hungry because we had to get up early to catch the boat. So we didn't have any time to eat anything. We went to the Big Bamboo to get some breakfast. And then after that, he hooked us up with his friend who owns a speedboat. And we went on a little tour that ended up being more than a tour because we actually got into the water, which we didn't have any plans to do. That day was very spontaneous and it was one of the best days of my life. Very relaxing, so chill, around good energy and just underwater living life. <laughs> Good morning, good morning, I'm Kenrick, aka Daddy, Kenny. Don't know. What are we doing? What are we about to do? We're about to do a tour now, we're going to East End now. About to rock the boat. Hey! Okay, we're about to do a tour. Oh, hell no. Hell no. <laughs> that water's salty. Ugh. What do you want to do? Ah! Yeah, like I'm good. <laughs> Cut the cam. We're now on a boat with in the middle of the Caribbean Sea. <laughs> so if we die, and y'all find this, tell Rosalind. 
I love you. Sheila, I love you. <laughs> oh, Sheila. My mommy. Oh, wow. <laughs> We visited Conk Island. Basically, I don't know if you guys know what a conk is, but you will see it's basically an island made up of conk shells. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Like, it's just a sight to see, and I'm happy that I can share this, share this sight with you guys because it was so beautiful and the water looked so good. Zen's first time having lobster. So the place that we had the lobster was Anigata Beach Club and there's a beach along the trail and we ended up there on the beach and listen y'all that breeze was out of this world like it felt so good on my face on my body we laid down on some beach chairs and I felt so relaxed and so at peace that all I could have done was fall asleep. I loved it, okay? Like the breeze was hitting. We're on our way to whatever she just said. I don't know. I that. <laughs> We're on our way to King Garden Bay. Yeah. So today is going to be more like a chill day. I look like I literally just woke up. I look like sleep. Then what are you looking like? You're looking like a snack. <laughs> We're about to just chill and relax on the beach. It's our friend Kim. Say hi to the vlog. We're gonna go in the water soon. But uh, have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> After Anigata, we went straight to Tartola, which is the main island in the British Virgin Islands. Following morning, we went to a, another popular beach in Tartola, which is called Cane Garden Bay Beach. And that day was basically a day to relax and to unwind. To prepare for the next day, where we went sailing to Willy Tees. Two... 38 in the morning and I don't know where Major is but she's safe she's in good hands listen y'all last night was too real I can't even tell y'all what happened because it was your discretion is advised <laughs> Today is another day. We're going sailing today. And we're going to Willy Tees, which is a popular attraction for like tourists. I mean, locals go there too. A lot of people anticipate jumping off of the upstairs into the water. You can you do that today? My face has been suffering. Cause too. What do you call them? Dry spots when you're in the sun too much? Mm. Like my skin is peeling. Oh, it's peeling. Oh, mm -hmm. oh wow. Oh, my water intake has been trash. <laughs> so, no, but you probably drank like one bottle of water since, since you came. I know, and it's only on a trip. Usually when I'm home, I have my water bottle and it fills up. Mm -hmm. Now that it's hot girl summer, you know. We're at coffee. the pear park. We're gonna get some coffee, some frappuccinos or something like that. Yeah, and then we're gonna meet Kim to go sailing. In order to get to Willy Tees, you have to sail there and you have to cross over on different boats sometimes to get on top of the boat. So Willy Tee is a floating boat in the middle of the ocean. I won't say in the middle of the ocean because I mean it's near an island but it's basically in the ocean. We get that point. <laughs> Let me try the boat! I'm gonna 
having so much fun at Willy T's. After that, we ended up at a pool party. The crew that went to Willy T's, we went to one of the guys' house, and we basically had a pool party. We had burgers, we had drinks, and we were just in the pool, chilling, talking. It was a cool vibe, and we had to travel back to Virgin Gorda to celebrate my friend Ron's birthday and I went jet skiing for the first time ever and how come y'all didn't tell me jet skiing was so fun if you've tried jet skiing before I mean the aftermath how your body feels and all your muscles and everything like that obviously not the fun part because after that I was so sore I am alive we're getting ready to go jet skiing as you can see we are Oh, wow, I probably look high. I'm a high guy. <laughs> so tired. <laughs> Don't put that in. Insta snap. Hi to Miri's Instagram. You don't know me by that name. Come on, conquer it. Razor, Razor Empress. <laughs> Razor Empress Instagram. We're here with a gang today. Hey. And we're going jet skiing. Yes, sir. So once you're more or less in the middle, you basically have to look out for the other jet skis and boats. Okay? There's right. a poach in the jet ski. Yeah. From the fastest one, I want to. We in there. Hey, You're lying on the wine line. line. Okay, tell me blue on the last time. Tell me blue on the last. It is. He look good, and I'm on the way. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Had fun. Nearies are right up. I didn't think she'd have been going so fast, but yeah, she did. We got you guys falling off. Twice. We did. We fell off twice. But only we fell off, you know? Your girl was throttling in the water, and thank God I had Bobby do it with me. He teach me the ropes and show me how it's done. At one point, I was so scared because he was going so fast. But then once I got the gist of it, it was his time to be scared. So. We were even, and later on that day, we went to dinner. Ooh, we got light over here. Hi, boo. We're here at dinner for Ron's birthday. Today's his birthday. We got Bobby in the cut. Can't believe why that light is blocking. Yeah. Mm. I don't know if these people are the birthday. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. But we did jet skiing earlier and I'm more from Okay. Bobby was my ride or die. I almost kill you. Oh, it was fine. Bobby, you sexy. Yeah. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> like he handsome bad for me. We went to Sugar Cane restaurant in Nail Bay. I had a lobster pizza. It wasn't amazing, but it tasted real good. So if you good. do come to Virgin Garda, that's a nice restaurant for you guys to try out. Sugarcane Restaurant. I'm giving them plugs like they paying me. Hey world. I'm leaving Tortola. It was a great trip. We had so much fun. We drove the boat. We got lit. I'll be back soon. Don't worry. <laughs> that was basically it. Not really. I showed you guys about 50% of my staycation. There were some things that happened that I'm not proud of, but you know, young, wild, and free. Um, <laughs> wow. The staycation ended on such a positive note for both my friend and I. I needed that little break to have some fun because I've just been working, 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 working. I've taken like a day break or two, but not like for a good week to just relax and not worry about posting or filming and stuff like that. So I was happy that I did and I really enjoyed it. Unfortunately, my friend left and she arrived back to Atlanta safely. As I told you guys on Instagram, all my close friends 
are thousands of miles away and it hurts because I can't just be like, hey, can't, let, let, let's chill, let's go here, let's go there, let's, let's just relax. I can't do that. I have to wait months sometimes years to see my friends. I was so happy. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. More vlogs and stuff like this will be coming. Like I'm slowly getting in there. Hey Angelique. Hi Dora. What you eating? Hello. Amira. My face is breaking out, but we're gonna work on that. I'm here with my this staycation i can't wait to tell you guys later about it down the inner line what are you doing what are you doing what are you doing you're trying to stop it say bye bye hope you guys enjoyed the video thank you guys for watching see you in the next one Bye.